and had to wear Amy's shoes for warm ups. Thankfully, we found somebody with little feet. Uh, number four, one of my favorites. So, a couple, well, last week they were all sore, and I thought I'd do something nice and we would do some yoga to help them release some of their, their tightness, and it was unfortunately a complete disaster. These girls do not know how to relax, they do not know how to shut their mouth. And so we made the most of it, but hopefully, I'm glad it was a good memory. Uh, number five, Ashlyn tripping over Jaylee and hitting the floor. I think that was also on CIC. Great. Uh, number six, all the times that they had to run and Landry had to run because apparently they have this thing called daughterisms. I'm harder on her than anybody else, and as a result, they all have to run, or she has to run. Contrary. Number seven, bus ride karaoke. I think I've got that on video. I'll watch that later. And number eight, Avery has a habit of throwing elbows anytime there's a championship. I think it grant before she got a few people on the head. So. Okay, so I have something to say about each one of them. I promise I'll make it quick. I'm going to start in numerical order. So number one, Josie Jones. Yeah. Okay. I'm sure everyone knows by now, Josie's never played volleyball before. This is her first year. And I'm sure it was super intimidating to come out and play with these girls. A lot of these girls have played for four or five years, and she's never played before. But she came out to every practice. She worked her butt off. She made this team better because of the work that she did in practice. Not to mention, she's probably the funniest girl that I've ever met. She made them laugh, and I'm so glad that you played this year. You're doing great at the team. Thank you. Thank you. 
get a little defeated. She showed up in the huddle and she told these girls, she said, guess what? I'm not giving up on you guys. Don't give up on me. We are not giving up. And I thought that was super cool of her to say that to her teammates and I really appreciate it. So thank you for being a part of this program. 
program, you're such a big part of it. And finally, Mr. May, he's been an amazing athlete for all of He does more for these girls than they deserve. Now for Shelly. Behind every successful team is a dedicated coach who refused to let them be anything but the best they can be. Not only did Coach lead us to winning our second third board and Jackie titles, but she was also passionate about every player and believed in every single one. What makes her such a good coach is the perseverance and determination she showed all season, seeking the best of us from out of the postseason. Shelly will have a long time effect on all of us the way we see the game of volleyball. Thank you from all of us for the best eight period season we could ask for. Thank you, parents. You guys are so supportive.